G'day, it's uh, Jeff from Norwood Sawmills Australia. I want to speak to you about milling Australian hardwoods with a Norwood band sawmill. Now, a lot of people believe that these sawmills will not cut Australian hardwoods, they'll waver, you won't get good cuts, the blade goes blunt after half a cut, you have to wedge when you're cutting. I want to assure people I've done an extensive amount of milling. I've milled timbers such as ironbark, box, I've even milled timbers that have been dragged out of saltwater lakes that have been contaminated, highly contaminated with salt. We've, we've milled old railway sleepers, we've milled uh, ironwood, which is incredibly hard up in the Northern Territory. Well, Hobby down in Western Australia, another very difficult timber, and of course Gidgee. And Gidgee, as you know, is one of the uh, nastiest timbers on the planet. If these machines are set up right, they will definitely cut Australian hardwood every day of the week. And they won't, as I said, just one blade, one log. You will get a lot of cutting out of that blade. So if you're looking for a mill to maximise your investment, this is the machine for you. An advantage of these machines is they can cut incredibly wide. The HD36 can cut up to 27 inches and the LM29 can cut up to 22 inches. The kerf thickness on these machines is less than two mil. So you're not leaving all your sawdust on the ground. Your recovery rate is over 70% on these machines. You can cut valuable slabs and you can also cut dimensional timbers. You can pull really good straight boards off these machines. They're an excellent return for your money.